Let's talk about Rex files, more specifically how you can import your own audio files um, into Reason and then take certain bits of those files and export them as Rex files to use in either Kong or the Dr. Octo Rex, um, where you can do even more manipulation or uh, use them to creating for creating beats, whatever you can dream up. So let's go get started with this. I'm going to uh, take one of my old songs and I've just navigated to a folder that has some some really old tracks of mine. I'm going to drag one of them in and I'll F3 and get rid of the browser. Hit G so we can zoom in and I'm just going to play, a, I'm going to take something We've got a lot of transients going on here, so I'm going to take something from this area. I'll play a bit of this so you can hear what we're starting out with first. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and bring up the razor tool by hitting R, cut there, Q for the selection tool, select that and delete it. Just clean things up a bit. And let's zoom in a bit more. Actually, I'll use the new zoom function by hitting Z. So I will... Let's see. Let's say I'll just take for simplicity sake, I'll take this these last this last bit here. So I'll trim there. And get rid of this there. And actually, I'm going to turn the snap off because I want to cut right about there. So now I've got this clip. It's a single take clip, so I can double click, get the inline editor. Let's just hear how that sounds. And I think maybe I want to get this whole bit, get even more there. I'll use this whole thing, double click. Let's play back. And actually, I think I'll use that first bit there. Escape out, delete that second part, double click. Let's zoom out with H. And so before you export your imported audio as a Rex file, you can just know that you can adjust these slice, slice markers. You can move them wherever you'd like. Reason automatically places them where it senses transients at. Uh, so actually, I think I'd like to get rid of these three here because they're they're this is really not anything that I'd want to have sliced up so I'll just drag and select those three and simply hit delete but just know that you can drag and move when you adjust these it's going to be based on whatever your snap value is set to so if you'd like to move these a bit more freely just turn your snap off and then you can adjust like so. I'll control Z. Actually, I don't want those back, but so now uh, all you have to do is right click, go to choose bounce, bounce clip to a Rex loop. Reason will bring up the browser and show you that just that quickly we now have this audio that we've um, 
cut out the section that we want to use and we've got the uh, slices now as a rec, rex file now if you want to load up the dr octo all you have to do is simply double click I'll f3 and get rid of the browser f6 for the rack and we now have our audio file that we imported as a rex file in the dr octo rex i can run that Okay, one other thing, uh, and then you can just use, do any manipulation in here that you'd like to do. This can also be brought into, let's go to the Kong, drag that in, select that first pad, show the drum and effects area, and change the drum module to a Nurse Rex Loop player. Go to the Browse folder double click on our audio file and it's now loaded into Kong so you can then change the hit type for this pad and say you just want to trigger certain slices select slice trig now you can go in using this wheel and just select whichever slices you'd like to play maybe you only want to play one right now we're on that first one let's say you just would like this here so we'll select that as the trig triggered slice and you've got that uh maybe you want to alternate between so we'll choose wheel over to this one and select that okay you could even uh, reverse this one. Let's reverse that. So there's all sorts of things that you can do. I just mainly wanted to show you really quickly how simple it is to bring in your own audio and export it as a Rex file to have Lots of creative potential with writing your music. All right, thanks for watching.